Hello. I'm shredding some evidence here. Uh, nah, just planning on uh, selling a hard drive. Uh, well, two hard drives, actually. So where were we? It's 1986.2. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, the second month. It's just kind of funny. Profit, not that great, but we are waiting for the second month, though. Uh, if only I could remember how uh, I actually am playing this game. Yeah, yeah. Uh, minus 20 hundred millions, it says here. Okay, so where shall we uh, try and cut from? Uh, diploma recognition as well. Defcon is still at three. Hmm. Not that awesome. Ah, yes. Let's. Ch nah, we really sh should just uh, check what's our budget like next uh, turn. Yeah, before we do anything else. Loyalty is pretty decent there. Maybe we can uh, cut from that. <laughs> cut from our loyalty. Power of KGB. It might be a decent idea to keep it high, though. Eh, whatever. Can we even? Okay, there we go. The end of a five-year plan. Another five-year plan is going to end and we need to make demands for the new one. If you think uh, uh, that demands are too low and the country can get more, double the demands. If you think uh, that the demands are too high, you can lower them. In other case, uh, you can let it be the same. Uh... Um, we want money, uh, but how does that translate into this? Um, I, uh, I, I don't know, just leave it the same. Plan is being fulfilled. To fulfill this plan, we had to spend some resources for administrative apparatus. Oh no! Look at our profit, it's minus 65 still. Eh. I think we should maybe take a look at uh, what things we are subsidizing currently. Country development uh, 91. We. Uh, Wait, uh, did this uh, lower the disapproval level? Yes, it did. Okay. Uh, we should maybe lower it there as well. Disapproval. Okay, uh, actually, let's uh, look at all these uh, places before we do anything else. Now, these places I uh, might be able to get some uh, resources from. I don't see any countries r really being uh, maximized at uh, their country development, though. It's our highest developed. Uh, it would be Tunisia. So we will be extracting some some stuff from you. There. How's our budget doing? That is not good. Our army, uh, right wing loyalty is pretty bad. Uh, our stability, 
could be better, but our production is through the through the roof, of course. And HDI isn't bad either. Luxuries, yeah, we could do with some more, I suppose. Houses are starting to get to the point where uh, I want them at. Mind liberalization is uh, good. Agriculture, we don't need all this agriculture. Uh, oh, wait a minute, where did I... Uh, ah, here we go. Uh, how about we lower it to 60 uh, for now? And see where that lead uh, leaves us. At, mm, our intellectuals don't really like us. Uh, I don't know how to make them happy. Uh, I mean, subsidies are also... I mean, bribes are also... Or envelopes are also pretty uh, expensive. Hard industry, we aren't making any hard industry and we can we can't go into the negative either <laughs> number of army not good forgery in plans i don't know what uh, what that means the usa's uh, army power economy and citizens content are still uh, up there unfortunately we are doing some exporting and we have some competitiveness not as high as I might like, but I don't know what to do about that. Maybe some kind of a policy? I have no idea. Minus 2400 million still. And... Hmm. Apparently these other social spendings are pretty important. I didn't, I didn't really look into it, but... Maybe I should have them even even higher, but I don't understand why. <sighs> Arg. What's our law and order looking like? We are having a whole lot of that as well here. Position. Law and order, it's good. We are going to cut down on law and order big time, actually. Wait, wait a minute. Where did we get all this? Oh, because I lowered state mechanism, not uh, law and order. So, um, let's see here. We, it was at 150, maybe, uh, before. I'm going to guess. <sighs> and now we are, have a bit of a surplus. What's our uh, gold reserve do, doing like? Uh, we should have some more in it. Yeah. We are going to try to get it up. Actually, let's try to do it this turn, since uh, we might want to be able to... Uh, ...able to... Uh, ...get money from, from those other countries, yeah. Yeah, so there we go, it's over 400. Excellent, excellent. Our political powerpoints are at 85. I'm going to have to look at the uh, all of the policies that we might be able to do at some point. Okay, Sakharov's letter. In 1980, one of the, the creators of Soviet H-bomb, Professor Sakharov, was exiled in a town of Gorgi for his support of opposition and protest against Afghanistan intervention. Now Shkarov sent you a letter in which he promised to focus on scientific work and st st stop a pu public 
pro protests if his wife is allowed to go to Moscow in order to improve her health. It will be considered to be a rise of political freedom by the party and the world. However, it can encourage opposition to continue destroying our country. Uh, if his wife is allowed to go to Moscow in... We don't want uh, our freedoms to go too high. Uh, it's... That mind's liberalization is going to be... I don't want to make it whatever that Shararashka is uh, either. But sh do, do I want to ignore anything like this either? I I think I'm going to try to ignore that. See what that will do do to us. Yeah, I don't want to make the USA uh, really angry either. Sakharov's letter is ignored. He will look for other ways to achieve freedom. <laughs> Our political powerpoints are rising, though. Um, mm, yeah, we can't really do that. And we have already... Well, we have this modernization of carrier rockets path. But I don't want to go, go that uh, angry kind of uh, militaristic. Okay, so what can we do on the world stage? Disapproval level that much. The country development is getting up there. We can't get the... Okay, we are nearing the point where uh, the... We have to start lowering the disapproval. It's it might be bad if we don't. Ah, and we have this Somalia here as well. Um, how about we remove subsidies from one of these countries or whatever? Yeah, that seems like a decent idea. We have all this, all this place. Uh, I want to zoom out, see what it's, what the world map is looking like. We uh, are conquering parts of Africa and, uh, well, Brazil, I suppose, is a pretty huge chunk of uh, Latin America as well. Uh, but. They still have a pretty large foothold there, the uh, capitalists. Uh, otherwise, well, it's looking pretty normal. Ah. Uh, have we sent uh, weapons here uh, this year yet? Uh, I don't know. Okay, only at minus 100 million, so that's decent. We can work with that. Religious education. It is proposed to free all spheres of life from a religious influence, including ban of all re religious activities in schools and children participating in them. Uh. Free all spheres of life from religious influence, including a ban of all religious activities in schools. Well, I'm not against banning uh, religious activities in schools. We should kind of not push uh, any religious propaganda on our children. Uh, but it says all spheres of life. 
Our way is a freedom of conscience. <laughs> I mean, you, does this still mean you can, uh, like, we won't interfere if you practice uh, religion at uh, home? Uh, like, yeah, it's it says religious education. We don't really want a religious education in our schools. Yeah, just, yeah. Publish the new law, I'm thinking. After the beginning of the month, parents in the USSR will be banned from any attraction or force to take part in a religious life in the country. Ban will cover all religious events for children. Also, parents are banned from enrolling religious beliefs and making them to wear religious clothes. Okay, well, hmm... Maybe we we went a bit uh, far. Oh well, it's done. New document says that if parents are unable to protect their children from religious influence and if children don't w want to visit normal schools, parents must s send them to a special correctional schools for rehabilitation. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I don't yeah, pe people didn't really like that, I see, I see, I see. Our budget is not doing great. It's constantly dwindling away. But our uh, relations aren't that bad, I suppose. How are we doing? Employment is good, houses, yeah, I suppose, essential commodities, they are good. Availability, I don't see anything, well, hard industry still there. Our intellectuals really hate us. Self-fulfillment is going down, it's still up there, I suppose. Services. We might be able to cut it down on services, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, total military power is at least rising. That's, that's, that's so low. Corruption is getting up there. Uh, KGB loyalty, good. Power of KGB. Okay, I'm going to cut down on the KGB by just that tiny bit. Order... Uh, is that doing great? And order... It's up there, I suppose. We don't really have much mind liberalization at all. They don't know anything about the outside world and whatnot. Because Soviet, uh, well, uh, Russia and uh, what, what, what's, what's this? Uh, hmm, Soviet Union, yes, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, they are the best here. <laughs> uh, Okay, so what can we do on the world stage? Disapproval is up there in these places. Ca yes, we can send military aid. Excellent! Military aid there as well. Excellent, excellent. More? Yes! Yeah! Okay, not anymore. 
That's fair enough. Okay, remove subsidies from Nicaragua as well. We can't... We can't really uh, afford all that. What's going to rise our... Make our... Uh, total military power rise to the... Uh, or number of army, I suppose, would be that. What I'm looking for a rise to the... Uh, fastest, I wonder. Uh, I don't want to just spend all my money on uh, uh, army, either. That doesn't seem like the greatest of ideas, either. I don't think. But let's spend some on the army, yeah. And hmm, we could give some to the reserves as well, sure. Let's g give a bit there. Yeah. It'll be fine. Anti-alcohol campaign, yeah, well. It is going on now. What should we do next? Um... I don't think it's going to make many friends uh, leaving, uh, I mean, having this uh, price raising campaign, rising campaign still, uh, but uh, we are not having a great, our population isn't that happy with us. We. I might want to try to look for other ways to campaign against alcohol or whatever. I don't know. <sighs> whatever. After the anti-alcohol campaign was finished, alcohol products continued to give money to our government. Then people started to drink alcohol products more because the amount of it had increased. Doctors are sounding alarm. Minus 600 million. It's not that bad. We can work with that. Okay, we have still some subsidies in uh, Bolivia. Do we have subsidies anywhere else? I'm just looking for that. Uh, so I don't uh, do anything thing stupid. Leave them ongoing. Costing me money. Oh, Somalia! We have uh, subsidies in Somalia. I'm glad I checked. Okay, we can't really do that. Um. It's just resource extract from some of these spots here as well, yeah, sure. Fair enough. I really would like to start subsidizing some other country as well. Uh, let's say, where shall we subsidize? Guinea Bissau, whatever. Or Maybe Tanzania, it's not doing that great on our, on their approval, yeah, maybe. Sure, we'll subsidize Tanzania. You can't send military aid, unfortunately. All right then, uh, we don't have enough political power to do anything uh, of interest. Science is still getting up there. Yeah, we are still uh, maintaining, maintaining our scientific lead. Well, I don't know if it's a lead, but still you get the idea. The Colonel from Sverdlov. 
The distinguished political figure, former first secretary of Svetlov, uh, a provincial committee who greatly improved the, the local housing and supply situation and also obtained the permission to build the local metro, now is running in Politburo candidates in Likachev's recommendation. The decisive word is yours. The colonel from Svetlov. Uh, We are going to do a thorough check, I suppose. Sounds like a, a, a like a reasonable thing to do, yeah. In the course of the comprehensive inspect inspections of the activities of Yeltsin, yeah. Also because I heard that Yeltsin uh, uh, might be the one who kind of causes the fall of the Soviet Union kind of a thing. That's also why I uh, was wary on that. Uh, inspections on the activities of Yeltsin on a post uh, of first secretary of the Sverdlovsk Regional Commission found the additions in the number of indicators in the supply area. However, overall performance was posi positive, but admission to the candidates of the Politburo was denied. Uh, found the additions in the, in the number of indicators in the supply area. Mm. I, I don't quite understand what uh, all that meant, but whatever. What's our require? Well. What are our stats uh, looking like? Military. By the way, do we have any state propaganda going? Yeah, we do. We can absolutely cut down on that. I completely forgot about uh, that we have some of that still going. Export. Yeah, we, our stability isn't that great, but otherwise we are doing decently. Our HDI isn't, isn't as great as it was. Uh, but it's still a kind of up there, I suppose. Generous KGB, yeah. Power of KGB is still uh, rising. Mm -hmm. Level of education. Uh, I suppose we... I don't know. Luxuries. Um, it's... Wait a minute, it's the... Was it the KGB also that... Like, I, I've already forgotten what uh, gets our luxury better. Whatever. Employment is good. Essential commodities, good. Hard industry. Yeah, and agriculture. We don't need all this agriculture. No, thank you. Uh, let's lower it once again. We have 6,600 millions now to spend, suddenly. <laughs> Even though our budget is, uh, has dropped almost, well, 364,000 uh, millions, I suppose, by that amount, I suppose. Let's see how, whether we can... Uh, Send any military aid. Yeah, we can send military aid. That's at Fort and Yeah, we don't want... Uh, okay, so something went wrong there. Again. Uh, maybe I should drop the subsidies from here as well. I don't know. A hundred and one hundred millions. I'm in the money. <laughs> what are we going to do with all this money? Should we just bank it? I mean... Or should we subsidize some more countries? That doesn't sound like that bad of an idea, actually. 
Madagascar, they hate us there pretty much. Let's subsidize there, I suppose. We are very nice people. 